Hello friends, this is Hiren and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how you can install Android OS on your laptop or PC without doing any partition. This is one of the most safest and secure method to install Android OS on your PC or laptop. We will be installing Bliss OS and Phoenix OS for the people who want to play PUBG Mobile. Before I start, I would like to tell you all, please watch the video completely before proceeding. First, we will download Bliss OS. You can go on blissos.org and you can download Bliss OS ISO from there. Download now. We will download Bliss OS 11 as it is stable. Uh, Bliss OS 12 is in beta stage. Here it is a Bliss bot. Here you need to type Bliss OS. 11 and we will download x86 64 generic builds if you wish you can donate some to the developers of this OS so let's click on x64 generic builds it will take you to sourceforge.net click the first link I will be placing the link in the description I have already downloaded so I won't be downloading I will close this page next you need to go to Phoenix OS and we will download ISO image please note we won't be downloading exe installer we will download ISO image you can download from anywhere Google or Mega whichever you like before we start guys please watch the video completely and please like share and subscribe once you have downloaded all the files now it's time to change some settings in the BIOS that are very important restart your laptop or PC while pressing the shift button on the keyboard and it will take you to the advanced menu wait for some time and We'll go to Troubleshoot, Advanced Option, UEFI Firmware Settings. This is the easiest way you or else what you can do is when you, you can restart your laptop or PC and keep on pressing F10, delete button, whatever works for you. I'll, but I like to do this way, UEFI Firmware Settings, Restart. Okay, so I am in BIOS. The things you need to change is boot, go to boot and fast boot. Yeah, fast boot you have to disable it. Boot mode you have to keep it UEFI with CMS or UEFI. It won't work with legacy devices, so there is no need to keep legacy. Next is security, secure boot and disable it. I have already done it. Disable it. That's it. Escape. Save configuration and reset. Yes. I have downloaded both the ISO files. So, first we will install Bliss OS. Go to the Bliss OS ISO file, double click over it, and copy this file Android x86 installer. Copy it. and paste it in the folder the next thing we gonna do is right click over it and run as administrator once that is done we will select our ISO image bliss OS 11.10 .10. open it okay now the tricky part comes is we need to choose the drive the hard disk which has windows on it the partition may be whichever C, D, E, that doesn't matter. So I'll select D drive and you can choose whatever size you want, data size. So I'll go with 16 GB for now. Okay, and press install. 
by the time please friends don't forget to subscribe and please watch the video completely before proceeding it's very important that you should get this message install done install finish and install done once this is done you have to click ok if you wish you can report the status to the developers okay now we will see where this OS has been installed I have installed it in my D drive and here it is the Android OS folder it says 17.6 GB okay these are the files the next thing we will do is we gonna boot in bliss OS it's beautiful OS for the PUBG players we will shift to Phoenix OS and that also I will show you how you can do it very easily without changing or without doing any partition if you wish to play PUBG mobile on your PC or laptop then I would advise do not boot into bliss OS and if you think that you can go to Android x86 installer directly and install Phoenix OS in the similar way as I have installed Bliss OS then it's not gonna work I'll show you see installation failed it's not gonna work so please if you are willing to play PUBG and if you like Phoenix OS and don't boot into Bliss OS okay guys now let's boot into Bliss OS for that what we'll do is press the shift key go to Windows power and restart once that is done choose use a device Android OS and wait for the PC to boot into Bliss OS and there are a few options over here if you got a GPU then use this fourth menu fourth option wait for it and so finally we have booted into bliss os you see it's very easy that's it we have successfully booted into bliss os desktop mode or whichever mode you would use to like If you are not interested in playing PUBG then you can stop over here and just to use this OS if you restart you will go back to Windows so let's restart well to restart I will press the power button and here comes the option and I'll select restart And here we are back on Windows. Okay, so as I had already booted it to Bliss OS, now it's time that I cannot install Phoenix OS in the same way as I had installed Bliss OS. So I will again do the same procedure, we will again install Bliss OS first, D drive 16 GB, ok install. To install you just need to do is clean up Android and it will automatically remove all the entries which had been created earlier and all the files which had been created earlier for the Android OS. Install done, installation finished, now the tricky part starts. Let's install Phoenix OS okay once it is done as I told you earlier do not boot into bliss OS okay okay I'll close this now I will go to the Phoenix 
OS installer. Double click and I'll copy this file. One, two, three, four, and five. This five files I'll copy and I'll paste it in the folder where Android is installed. I had selected D drive and here is the folder Android OS. Now, now just paste it over here. That five files you need to paste it over here. Replace the files in the destination. Okay. And you are done. The two files which are not affected are Android boot and data. Now let's boot into Phoenix OS. And uh, before we boot into Phoenix OS, I would like to tell you guys, please subscribe. Okay guys, now let's boot into Phoenix OS. Start, I'll press shift button, power and restart. user device android os wait for your laptop to boot and here it is i will select a gpu android x86 x force vsa as my laptop supports graphic card so i'll select it if you don't have any graphics card then go with Android x86 that is also fine and go with GPU so I wish you luck enjoy PUBG mobile on your Phoenix OS And here it is guys Phoenix OS now enjoy your favorite PUBG game on your laptop very easily I'll skip it for now skip anyway finish and here it is my friends you can now easily play PUBG mobile on your laptop or desktop computer that's it for today's video guys enjoy Bliss OS and Phoenix OS on your laptop or computer and to install just you need to do is run the same installer and select cleanup android thank you